coming into Stanford Park. All right, in this video, we're gonna be touring the premier subdivision of Huntington, West Virginia, Stanford Park. This video is gonna be a little bit of an experiment as I'll be giving you facts on real estate, what the houses are like here and what you're actually buying into while driving around the community. If you don't know who I am, my name is Justin Dickey. I'm a realtor here in Huntington, West Virginia, and I'm available to help you with your buying and selling needs. So give me a shout. Also, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. Uh, we'll be checking out other communities, businesses, events in the area, so we know what it's like to live in Huntington, West Virginia. Now, Stamford Park has roughly 106 homes within its boundaries. And in the, fa uh, the past five years, uh, 32 homes have sold. So that's roughly about six coming on the market per year. And at the time of recording, there's actually three on the market right now. So in the past five years, out of the 32 homes that sold, uh, the average price point was about 332,000, with the median price point being 280,000. And that is from a range of 199,000 all the way up to, I think it was uh, $590,000. And from the data, the data given from those five years, taxes came in to be about eighteen hundred to five thousand dollars per year, with the average being two thousand eight hundred dollars for your property taxes. Now, Stamford Park is just a few minutes away from the center of the city. Tons of green space over here, well manicured lawns. And living here, you are expected to pay a $75 HOA fee per year. There's a deer over there. Hello. Nope, okay. Uh, past five years out of those homes I sold, the square footage of living space was between 2,000 to 7,000 square feet, the average being 3,400. Most of the homes in that data set, they were built in the 80s, a few in the 90s, and one of them was even built in 2007. Most of those, home, most of those homes were either four or five bedroom, but some of them, came out to be three or seven better. And then the number of full baths, most of them were two full baths, with second place coming in at three full bathrooms, and then a handful of those homes had even more than that. The typical, light, uh, typical lot size around here 
is 0.37. Sorry, I'm driving, getting distracted. Uh, 0.37 of an acre. And none of the homes were on a lot size greater than one acre during that five years. In terms of walkability, there's not so much traffic around here, so you can get out, get some exercise, uh, walk the dogs. However, to get to any amenities, you're probably going to want to take a vehicle. If I miss any facts, I'll throw them in when I get home. Hope you like this type of video. Again, if you're looking to buy or sell in the Hunt Huntington or Barbersville area, give me a shout. I'll leave my contact info in the description below. And if you like this type of content, please let me know, leave a comment. Now we'll just drive out of here. You can get a little more picture of what it's like to live here. And then I'll catch you in the next video. Thank you. See ya.